just wanted to show you a few features of the S2D2 mapping. Um, some of the, the new ones. Um, the ability to switch between time code and jog wheel, which is quite good. Anyway, I don't know if you can hear that, probably not that much. Just to, just to show. There we go. So to, to switch between time code or internal playback, just hold right shift and the effects draw where 1, 2, 3, and 4 are A, B, C, and D. Um, and that will switch between relative and internal. Um, that's, that's one of the new bits. Um, that only really applies to people who try to scratch, but it's, it's worth knowing that you can do it. Um, the delay freeze is now tap in and then tap tempo reset and away it goes. If you move um, gain A and B that will change the filter and feedback and um, sample volume will affect the, the length of the delay. Right, um, to get so there's MIDI, I'll keep changing the name, um, I don't know, button fire mode or whatever. Just click, loop in on both sides, and the lights will flash. Or in, that you can do them individually. But then, just, yeah, when the lights all start flashing. Hold down the button and a different preset effect will, will cut in. Right, so, um, with effects button mode on deck A, the number one is a toggle so that the filter will keep going until you tap it again. Um, what else is there? So that's that's the, the button mode. To get out of it, just click the button again. Um, tapping in on either side will put you in job effects mode. Um, like so, there's um, ten all together. Just tap one. Like so. Um, this actually, on the right hand side, in and then press number two. And that gets you beat masher, lo fi, and turntable effects. The turntable effects, when it's wound to the right, will cut in and stop. Like so. It's, I like this, it took me ages. So, um, yeah, that's loop in on the right and number two. If, um, if you wanted it without, I don't know, say maybe just the beat masher. Um, sync, Q and play are effects 1, 2 and 3, so um, you can cut them off and set them to none. To get them back, just tap any of the presets again. So you wanted, I don't know, just the stop. Like so. No. 8 hot Q mode. Hit loop out and then sync, shift, Q, and play become five, six, seven, and eight. To delete them, hold in and tap them. So you can still, still delete. Um, with the delay effects, to delay deck C and D, press loop in and then effect 2 on either side for C and D, and that will 
um, start the delay freeze and um, tapping it again switches it off um, it's worth if you've been using it say to mix make sure when you go to cue the next track in that that you've switched it off just make sure it's not highlighted on the track to otherwise you know obviously it won't make any sound um, so yeah that's that um, to control deck C and D oh there's a reset as well if, if you you've been messing around and you, you're sort of stuck just hit Q and Q and then it will go back to standard control um, yeah and then decks to control deck D just tap the sample engage button there and that will go between you see if you're on deck B that one will flash and deck D that one will flash that's just so you can always quickly tell what deck the, the job will is going to control and the volume as well goes off the same um, there are ways to control when you're on controlling deck D you can control deck B's volume um, Pressing shift and tempo will affect the other side. You know, um, if you're selected D, it will select B volume, and the other way around, if you're selected B, it will then control um, D's volume. Um, so yeah, there's that. If I turn that one down. Okay, um, loop recorder. So you'd click. Dry wet on FX2. Um, all the buttons sort of dimly light up to let you know that it's on. Um, the third button deletes any loop you've currently got. Um, first knob, dry wet. Second, size. And the third is the crossfader curve. Fourth is Dexim. Um, that's actually quite nice, bang in the middle where it clicks. Um, yeah, so if you um, wanted to record a loop, you press button one to start recording. And that's our loop playing. Um, that can be copied to a sample deck. Um, just switch a deck to the sample deck. Hold down the opposite shift, and any of the you know one, two, three, or four will put it in that sample deck sort of bay, as it were. Um, number two to stop it. Number three to delete it. So we'll just stop that because it's horrible. If you want, if you were using um, say B and D at the same time, if you press and hold. Um, draw wet on the FX one, the lights will say one. For at the moment, I've got A and C on left, and B and D on the right. So you get the lights there to show you. Um, but you can change that. Just that would be all four on the left. That would put B and D on the right. So you can change that from the controller. And when you let the um, draw wet go, it will go back to standard mode.